These heifers are located in Pier, South Dakota. They're about 30 minutes north of Pier on the Tibbs Ranch. My fiance and I went and looked at these heifers at the beginning of August, and they were getting them up that day to ultrasound. All the people you see bringing in the cattle, a lot of them are the Tibbs family. And if you've ever been to Fort Pier, there is a museum for KC Tibbs. He was a famous rodeo cowboy. It's kind of neat to be on a famous family's ranch. These heifers are all from Montana. They're owned by Peter Frank and kept at the Tibbs Ranch. The genetics come out of Montana every year. Peter works with the Red Angus rep and tries to work with the same families who he's had good results with in the past. Last year his heifers topped the pier market and he had the ones that he was able to sell right off the farm. He didn't have to bring any back to his place, so they were they're kind of a in demand quantity. He AIs them and does a lot of things right, uses good genetics, and I was really happy with what we saw. I know I'm partial to the Red Angus breed, but I thought that they looked really good when we were there. They were also very gentle. The family rides through the cattle every day on horseback. The country out there is smooth enough to drive on, but I think it's just part of the lifestyle out there to check their cattle on horses. They're used to seeing people. Okay, now watch closely. Peter catches the back of the tag as he takes it out. He said it took lots and lots of practice, and over the years he got tired of picking them up, so he just learned to catch both pieces at once. I was also impressed with how efficient the family was working these heifers. They could probably do two every minute. They worked all 600, I believe, in one day. So this gives you an idea of what we saw on our trip to Pier, South Dakota to see these Red Angus spread heifers. If you have any more questions, contact Justin Angel. Thank you.